Hello, God's dear ones. I pray that wherever you may be, you are happy, healthy, and full of blessings. I wanted to share my testimony about how God visited me. The day my mother died, I was still mourning. My husband filed for divorce and separated from me. I was in a lot of pain and sadness. I had so many problems in my previous marriage with my husband that I attempted suicide several times. The last time I was taken to hospital, but luckily I was saved. I reached a point in my life where nothing in this world was valuable to me. I was going to commit suicide again. This time I was much more serious than before. But I was worried about my loved ones after my death. As I was sitting at home and thinking about suicide, I asked God, Do you want death or life for me? I will wait for half an hour. If you do something, I will not commit suicide again. I said this to God without any grudge or resentment. A few moments later, it came to my mind to at least request the Channel 7 prayer service team, which I already knew that if God does not answer me, they pray for my loved ones to rest in peace after my death. I sent my prayer request to dear ones and picked up my phone one last time to browse the internet. I saw that a message came to me from Channel 7 prayer service team. I opened the message and saw that one dear person said that I have read your message and God placed it in my heart to talk to you. When I read the message, I uncontrollably shed too many tears that no matter how much I wiped them, it wouldn't dry. I could hardly see the phone screen. I said to myself, did God hear my voice? What is going on? I sent a message and said, did God put it in your heart to talk to me? He answered, yes. This dear person started testifying about his life how God visited him and saved his life when he was waiting for death and wanted to commit suicide. I realized how much that person's life was similar to mine. I thought to myself, so it is definitely possible that my life would change like the life of this dear one. He asked me, do you want to give your life to God so that your life will change? I asked, how? He sent me the prayer of confession of faith and asked me to recite it with all my heart and confess with my tongue. I did that and the gift of salvation was given to me. I really thank God that he always looks after us.